honestly, I really don't know why, but my tanning color takes forever to go out, to get off my body. Like, I've been exfoliating and doing all the, the things that people told me to do, and it never comes off, like, completely. It's been, like, almost, I don't know, two weeks, and I still have some spots. In 8.1 miles, take exit 259 to merge onto I-4 toward Tampa. Okay, I will. So it's been, like, almost two weeks, and I still have some spots with the tanning. I shower twice a day, every day, morning and evening. The rest of the day I'm out, I can shower. <laughs> but it's so weird because I have to, I will be doing tanning again in two weeks. My next competition is coming. It's gonna be Memphis, the Dexter Memphis Classic. So yeah, I have to take it off. Uh, I even tried to do the baking soda. It's like, I will show you guys later what is the mixture that I use to take it off like it really helps helps a lot especially if your skin's like mine that soaks up the product completely and it takes forever to come off like every show is like that it's not just this one and it doesn't matter what product i use if it's gentana protein or whatever it's just my skin you know so yeah uh, carla from Pro protein she gave me some tips of what to do like a mixture to take the tanning off like very quick so that's very nice. I will tell you how to do it. Today is Saturday, carb loading day. Happy day. So right now I'm going I'm going to my chiropractor as I said. And then it's like across Whole Foods, so I'm gonna stop by Whole Foods and get some potatoes and some more rice. Then after that there I have some clients and then I might go home. I have two online classes to take today, even though it's hard today. In 1.3 miles, keep right to merge onto Florida's Turnpike. GPS is talking. So yeah, after online classes, I'm gonna go train. Probably around seven. That's the best time to train, like at the gym that I'm going today, because it's emptier. I'm gonna show you what I'll be doing my chiropractor. He's probably gonna be working my delts, rear delts, over back and a little bit my elbow is kind of sore i don't know what i did but i think when i was doing like triceps extensions i just messed up something but he'll be doing some grass tone and i'll be showing you guys so i'm on my way now to my chiropractor he will be doing some work in my elbows delts and upper back especially because that's what i'm training today on delts and upper back I'm gonna do some touch-ups on my rear delts as well. So I like to go there before, so he can do some work, some graston work, and it really helps with my range of motion. I feel better. I can do, you know, like engage better my muscles. <laughs> Try. <laughs> hey. Now he's doing grass in my doubts. So we're starting just heating up. 
and then he's gonna do some grass stone after that, and I'm gonna show you. Lower? Yeah. Let's see. That's, that's good. What happened to you? <laughs> um, my body went to trauma. <laughs> no, we kept it in the house, but um, without a doubt, I mean, it was useless. Okay, so what's going on? Alright, so Natalia has some scar tissue adhering her triceps and her biceps right here. And there's also nerves and arteries running through here, and that can actually influence how the elbow receives nutrition and flushes out. And it makes all the nerves extra tender. So we're just working on opening up those adhesions and getting that split back between her biceps and triceps. Yo, man, 